my dream of becoming a YouTuber. The beginning of 2020, so many things happened all across the world and with me. It all started back in March when a certain thing took place. Throughout the lockdown, I wanted to create YouTube videos and I did, but I wanted to create exciting and engaging ones. Ones where I could catch a person's interest. Videos where it wasn't just me sitting in my room, talking to a camera, but I was scared, anxious about the videos I planned and wanted to do. This was because I was nervous what people may say or how the video would have turned out or if the video would have been good enough. So I decided to do reaction videos and many of them. At first I enjoyed them but as time went on I hated them as they weren't allowing me to be creative and enthusiastic about what I was reacting to and it seemed like you guys realised this as well. So I stopped uploading and lost my drive and creativity to post because I had no clue on what I wanted to do. Throughout the whole year I said I was going to do this and do that and I never did anything. It sounded like I was talking but no action into what I wanted to become. In November of 2020 I posted a fitness challenge and decided to do that after Guys, seeing someone else hard, who inspired man. me. I'm tired. He's putting me through it from but I can't give up. This is just day one. 30 days more left. 29 days left. So let's get it. And that created the momentum I need to start creating again. Suddenly, at the end of the year, I said to myself, no matter how bad it is or how bad it gets, I'm going to make it. At that moment in time, I realised I was letting my mind and what every person that ever said about me control the actions about something I hadn't even done yet. From the age of 16, I always wanted to create videos and make people smile my personality on camera. Yeah, you You're going to do that to Explain what it is, man. So, what up, guys? Up until now, it feels like every year I plan on creating videos and gaining a big audience who I can connect with. But it never happens. Every year from the age of 16, I wasn't committed and consistent enough to see anything happen and always had this inner doubt at the back of my mind every time I said I wanted to achieve something big that would tell me I couldn't. And every year I would say next year I'll go out in public and do the videos I've always wanted to do. But it will never happen. I truly believe that if we keep saying we're going to do something but never attempt to do it, how do you think we're going to break our fears? You have to fully commit yourself with all possibilities of failing if you don't succeed because you will never know what you could have been. You have to fully desire what you want and be committed to achieve that goal. So, it was at the last couple of days of 2020 where I said to myself, this year I'm going to be extra confident even if I'm not. I will not be afraid to fail as success is a number of failures that never succeeded and I will learn not to give in when things don't go right. I will live every day with the determination to chase the dream I've always wanted and to heartily believe that with everything I do, God will push me to the place I've always wanted to be. So for the rest of 2021, live life, fail to succeed and never stop believing in your dreams. I'll see you next week. Bye. I'm leaving.